So, I forgot to make an intro to this video. Um, but basically, it's just me picking up a race car with uh, a couple guys and making my dream come true. 93 model four door diesel Chevy diesel. That's got the anemic 6.5 in it. Yeah. And. by a tractor trailer Ooh. as I was parked right next to the pumps. I was just getting ready to get out of it. So his, I, I grew up next near a racetrack five miles from my house. My mom took me there when I was 12. Stamp on it. So when they put that stamp on it, all of a sudden it's $500 more. Right. Yeah. This stupid ass motor from them is $35,000. I can buy a part for 10 grand if I bought them just from Chevrolet. Right. Yeah, I, yeah, I got you. I know. He, yep. he puts them together and they, they, they got a dyno room there. So his boss is David Lewis. That's his Yes. Yeah. Right. Yeah, David's his boss. Right. 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 Yeah. Yep. Because Robert, of course, Robert died. What, come there she is. Sitting in the hauler waiting to get home. Got a bunch of stuff for her. I'm excited. There's my ignition stuff. Tax. There's a steering column, cool. It's a little rusty, but we're okay. Clean that up. Got a lot of stuff for it. I'm very, very happy. Very, very happy. The suspension stuff right there. Um, yeah, I got my race car. I got my first ever race car. I'm a very, very happy man. <laughs> Um, oh my god, I'm so excited. So that's what's pulling it. Stopped at McDonald's. We're gonna get it home and figure out a place to store it. But until then, yep. But I got a modified, I'm happy. Well, She's home. I got to go to Lowe's real fast and get some jack stands and uh, be done um, for the day. I got to get tarp over it and then I'm going to remove the hood, clean it up, and I'm going to number it and put my name on there. But yeah, that's all the pieces. It's time to go to Lowe's and get the, uh, the jack stands. So now I'm in the car getting uh, going to Lowe's. I wish uh, Bobby worked here at this Lowe's because I'd ask him for his employee discount because it's going to be expensive. This is going to be an expensive buy right now, but I'm going to get jack stands for the uh, for the chassis. That way I can start putting the um, suspension system in. Once the suspension system in, I can get the... Uh, um, What's it called the um the rims for the tires and stuff put them on there and we'll be good then it can just roll be a nice roller um but until then that ain't happening uh, so let's just get those jack stands get these uh suspension parts on there as soon as possible and go from there but uh all right i'm gonna go in the lows and see what i can pick up here so well those doesn't have them. they have one one just one just one in a box is forty dollars just one it's a jack stand are you kidding me forty dollars for a jack stand we're going to our zone. Forty dollars for one jack stand? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Forty dollars one jack stand. Let me put my seatbelt in here, even though we're going right on the road. Forty dollars for a jack stand. Did you hear that, folks? Forty dollars for one. Craftsman. 
I like Craftsman a lot. They make good tools, but $40 for one jack stand? Bite my ass. <laughs> That's all I'm going to tell you. $40. Oh my God. I could see if it did something besides hold up something. It's just a paperweight. Anyhow, let's go to AutoZone. All right, kitties. I just went on a little rant about Craftsman with the $40, $40 for one. So, I went to AutoZone and in a box of two is $62. Box of two now, $62. Okay. So for price of one, I saved a bunch of money. I switched in the Geico. No, I'm kidding. Um, but yeah, shop around. Don't ever settle. Always get something good, good deal. Now, this is a four ton jack stand. So we're good. Because this car is nowhere near going to be four tons. I mean, no. <laughs> so yeah, shop around and get going here. <sighs> just for playing around i put the uh the nerf bars next to it and i just oh my gosh i'm so excited i got four rear nerf bars bars i don't understand why but uh the more the better i assume the rear bumper is back there um that's for the that's the main that's the firewall here is my steering uh, fuel hoses and shocks for the rear. Extra wheel hub. This is an extra... Uh-oh. All right, I see what that was. All right, so this here is a bucket of, a bucket of everything right there. I'm trying to piece everything together here. Oh, I got cut. I didn't know that. I don't remember what this is. I don't remember what that is. It's been so long. So I'm going to put that to the side. I'm not going to do anything with it because I don't remember what it, what it was. I don't even know what's in this box. I mean, this bag here. Oh, cool. Perfect. Okay. That's a bag of uh, everything I've been needing. All right. Again, it looks like it's cause. All right, that's an extra bumper piece. Cool, good to know. All right. All right. I'll protect these. All right. So that's that. There's my exhaust pipes. Gotta get the engine. So if you'd like to sponsor me and help me get an engine, let me know. <laughs> is that I'm living my dream I have a freaking modified and I'm so over the top excited oh my god I can't wait to put this together some of the some of the pieces for the body are in here or right in this box um, which is good because kind of put the I think this right here is the rear is the rear for it so in all reality I should take it all out and see what I have oh my god I'm so happy but yeah anyone want to come down and help me so rear ends back there I put a lot of the other stuff away um, I try to clean it off the hood. This is gonna come off. And this is gonna come off, and that. It's so funny because my number is thirty-seven, and you get the thirty-three. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna take care of that. Um, little information more about it. It was owned by a guy named uh, Kramer, uh Was it something Kramer in New Jersey? Uh, raced at Wall, my home track. Um, that I bought it off of Jamie Tomano. Um, it's a 2000 Troyer modified. 
And this is my dream come true. It's I've always dreamt of owning one. And uh, I'm one of the happiest people on the planet right now. Because I finally got my modified. And I get to build it. Put it together. I got to figure out how I can, where I could take it to get painted. And uh, go from there. Um, if you would like to help support me in this journey, uh, I'd be more than welcome to, to that. Um, I know there's a lot of uh, friends who want to help me build it with me. And I hope they can because I don't want to do this all alone. But, uh, that's my dream right there. That's my dream come true. A bare chassis ready to make some new memories and whatnot. Um, it was supposed to go into a storage unit, but the storage unit canceled on me. Uh, but they are still working with me to get me a storage unit. And, uh, yeah. When I first bought it, on Wednesday, I uh, was so choked up from happiness that uh, <laughs> I didn't want anyone to see that because I don't like it in the first place. But yeah, now oh, it's home, and I got that same feeling, it's a sense of pride and happiness and. Tell you what, God, I'm lucky. <laughs> I have a lot of bad things in life that happen and whatnot, but I keep pushing. I keep pushing for things to make me happy and do things that make me happy. And this is going to be one of them. I'm going to vacuum it out, give it a good cleaning when it's fully indoors, um, and not have to worry about the elements taking over. But, yeah, this, this is my modified. Oh, my God. 2,000 Troyer. Oh, luckiest man alive. So, yeah. It's going to be many updates. I have plans of being at my storage unit, filming, live streaming, and all this other stuff with the, along with the build and go from there and just just uh just take you along on this journey until race day whenever that may be i gotta get an engine i don't know how i'm gonna afford it but i'm gonna get it one um so that's why I'm, I'm gonna need sponsors and i'm gonna need it bad i finally got a modified oh my gosh i got a modified it's sitting right there it's sitting right there my modified oh I'm not going to sleep tonight. I'm going to call out of work and everything. <laughs> I just want to work on it. I just want to work on it. And that's all I want to do. Oh, by the way, if you've never seen... It's been a long time. But yeah, that's my Cadillac. That's the, that's, <laughs> that's, uh, that's why I have to work. Because I have to pay the payments on that. But I've never shown it before. I was supposed to a long time ago, but then my life took a turn for the worse, and I stopped really caring about things and just shut down to deal with my problems. But yeah, that's my Cadillac. But uh, but that's my modified, and I'm really happy. Oh my god, I got a modified! Ah! <laughs> oh, all the parts are in the garage except for a couple things. As I said, like the. The front suspension, I got one part here underneath that, and then the rear suspension. I got the shocks over in the back. I mean, you've seen them before, but yeah, y'all, this is going to be a fantastic build. I'm excited. I'm happy. And uh, I can't wait to get in the storage unit so I can start working on this stuff. That's a steering right there. Um, yeah. Y'all, your dreams are always possible. You just got to push for them and not worry about consequences or any of that stuff. I'll talk to you later and happy Easter.